and serve him whether you believe it or not after many lifetimes we have been traversing from one body to another in the Padma Puran Java Jawala Lakshana Snani Section and Equation Minor. So, uh, <laughs> you've not got 84. Uh, as you know from the. Didn't add this up. Lakshana Lakshani. In aquatics, in the 900,000. Trees, plants, and vegetation. 20 million. Sorry, 2 million. And insects. Uh, sorry, 3 million types of four, three legged animals. Kira, Kira, insects, types of insects in the stool. Sorry. Uh, you, if you remember this at the time of taking prashad, you will vomit. But we have taken uh, birth. One million one hundred thousand insects types. <coughs> two million. No, three three million types of four legged animals. And ma many birds, 400,000 types of human beings. Only even within that, there is just uh, by name they're called humans, but not actually humans. And they, they don't have a tail. We've lost our tail. But we're still behaving like uh, like monkeys. Darwin says we came from Bandar, we're monkeys. This is not correct. You've heard of Darwin's theory. This is not truth. The we have taken this human body, but we are living like animals. Uh, do, how do the animals live? They live by eating, sleeping, defending, and uh, creating offsprings. Like this, our life has gone by. He is even the Lord given the opportunity by giving sadhus and saints to slowly be able to come closer to him. So it said, by very good fortune, you have attained this human birth. One short story. Um, Brahma is the creator of this uh, who creates this uh, who creates the living beings the Brahmaji creates he gave everybody uh, uh, an age Sosa oh he gave a hundred years uh, sorry he gave twenty years age lifespan everybody gave he gave 20 years of lifespan. He gave everyone lifespan, the age to live life, only 20 years. So the humans, they said, well, what can I do in 20 years? Uh, 10 years I spent just uh, uh, in childhood. Nursery, and we play school. 10 years in play school. <laughs> it goes with a tiffin and comes back 
uh, after uh, eating and playing. And within another ten years and studying further, graduating to become expert in any one subject maybe it takes longer if one wants to be an uh, expert in, like a lawyer, do a uh, doctor, etc. It takes many years, like 30 years sometimes. So the human beings are complaining to Brahma, well, what can I do in 20 years? So the one that at that time one donkey came Sorry, one dog came. Dog came. So the dog said, I will have to stay 20 years also. What will I do in 20 years? I will, I will have to just live in somebody's house and, and bark. He said, to reduce my lifespan by 10 years and give that to the human beings. So now the human being's lifespan is 30 years and the dog's lifespan is 10. And so the human beings complain still to Brahma. 30 years is still not enough. Uh, I have to marry, uh, marry at the age of 25. I only have marriage life for five years. Uh, at that time, one donkey came. Uh, the donkey was given uh, 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 the donkey said I don't need I don't need 20 years to live uh, what am I going to do work all my life so he gave the 10 years of his life to the human beings now the uh, humans have 40 years lifespan so um, and then the donkey has 10 and yet still the humans complain, I cannot do anything in 40 years. All I will do is work. And then at that time a snake came. So he gave 10 years of his life to the human beings. So now the f humans have 50 years. Even 50 years is not enough for the human beings. Uh, yeah? Another animal came. Then he gave ten. That animal gave another ten years to the human beings. Sixty years now the human. Still the humans are not satisfied. Kal personified. Jara. he gave another 10 years, 70 years, Kal Jara, he gave another 10 years to the human beings. In this body there are so many joints and any problem in any of those joints we have so much uh, difficulty. <coughs> the, uh, the, uh, as you get older, they get worse. They did not put any screw. Lord did not create any screws or anything, nuts and bolts. He made it perfect. Lego, 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 Lego. Makano, I say. They play and they Lego. <coughs> mechanical thing. Yeah. If we remove the skin of, of our bodies, you can see the joints and uh, that you can attach the joints yourself. You'll see that there are no screws or nuts or bolts. A little cold or hot, we get pain, spondylitis, every shoulders, 
there's no time to perform bhajan. For this reason, the Lord is saying, Kumaram Acharit Pragya, we should start to do our bhajan at a young age. And this will stay with you. Everything else will go. Tulsidas in Ram Charit Manas is saying, once Devi Parvati told to Shiva, Oh, my Lord, you tell me, what is the fruit of uh, living in this world? Shiva said, Oh, Uma, Bharati, this life is like a dream. <coughs> this is, the, we are uh, as if in a dream, we are living. Does anybody have a dream? Yes. She's put her hand up and says, You, Guru, you have come in my dream. In this way, we are, we are in a dream. Sometimes we become a king, sometimes this or that. When we wake up, we are, we are sleeping on the floor. In this, in this way, we are um, living in the realm of uh, illusion and desires. These names of the Lord are like jewels. Who wants to take? Raise your hands. Huh? Raise your hands. Uh, no, you're scared to take. Something will happen. You're not sure what will happen. And this Hindi Kirtan is said. This Ram, Nam, and Krishna, Nam is uh, the goal of our life. That's why it is said, Lere Koi, whoever takes takes the name of the Lord, like these jewel, jewels I am distributing in every street. I'm distributing, but nobody's taking. Uh, if they have taken, they're not using. They're just hanging on the door, hanging on the wall. These names. You should take these names. You should perform bhajan. Whatever you see in this world, whatever you possess, one day you'll have to leave behind. What do you think? What's your name? Sha Shakshi. Jayanti. Shakshi. Jain. Shakshi means you are Shakshi, so you know. <laughs> Nobody will come with you in this uh, life at the time of death. And why have you come to this world to perform Hari Bhajan? So this Das is saying. Uh, so, in truth, we have come to perform bhajan, but we have forgotten. We are running here and there. Kambal, if you like a blanket, if you take one thread from that blanket every day, the blanket will be disintegrated. In the same way, we will not take anything with us. You came with closed fist, but you will leave with uh, open fist, open palm. When a child is born, they are born with closed fist. When they leave the body, they, they leave with the palms open. The significance is that we have come with our past karma, good or bad that we have to um, tolerate in this life. These are the fruits of happiness and distress. 
actually there is nobody who is giving us pain in this world or happiness. Shukadeva Goswami is saying in Srimad Bhagavatam O Maharaj Parikshit why people are doing a hard endeavor so why are you working so hard to get happiness for money why are you for uh, why are you earning money for happiness one floor second floor building third floor building now you have the TV but you're not satisfied so you get a big TV uh, that covers the whole wall 12 by by 14 like the size of this wall we see this in the foreign land or like a picture of the of Mahaprabhu like as big as that like a cinema s- theater screen hmm. passing their time in this way life is like that whatever you do in, in this time you will not take with you Nobody will go with you. According to your karma, nobody will come with you. But even if they come, what will they do? Papa, Daddy, what will, what can I do at the time of the father's death? Like Ajamil. Nobody could help him. <coughs> this is the result of karma, our activities. We are enjoying or suffering. We will come alone, we will go alone. We will have to, have to go. Nobody will come with us. And like we are going on the path, on the way, and we make friends. And then we have to uh, leave them. You've seen one large tree in a park in the, in the morning oh, at, after sunset. And then, uh, birds they come and stay in that tree making their chirping sound in the morning they all fly away and then they come back again to that very tree at night in the same way sometimes we gather and sometimes we disperse one story of a saint sadhu he was sitting under a tree he was doing his bhajan not bhajan bhajan means to eat (laughs) he was doing his bhajan and all the birds above him in the tree they were making noise at night chirping making their sound you see yeah there's a, there's a park just across the road at night time so many birds gather in singapore and this tree in singapore so many tre- when, uh, so many birds come there they have to complain to the um, government uh, the local council to cut the tree so they cause so much disturbance and the locals in that area they complain to the council to cut so. <laughs> so that uh, Sadhu Mahatma was sitting under the tree 
after one or two years and uh, they were they were uh, stooling on his on him yet the sadhu was not saying anything if somebody did that to us we would at least chase the birds away by clapping our hands but this sadhu mahatma was not saying anything and the birds started to think this this uh, sadhu is is not saying anything one day the, the birds came and spoke to the uh, sadhu and said to give them a mantra what mantra the sadhu said yeah, so the sadhu gave them one mantra to the birds he said that, told to them this mantra will be useful for you you should remember this mantra at the time of difficulty you chant this mantra and if you have any difficulties you remember me like this uh, I gave the mantra and the sadhu left the mantra was in Hindi in Sikari Ayanga एक दिन सिकारी आएंगे। जाल भी जाल बिछाएंगे, जाल बिछाएंगे, दाना डालेंगे। चने, दाने के दाना डालेंगे, not चने, डालें, कुछ seeds। Don't be trapped. Namat. Don't be trapped by the greed of the seas. Repeat. Dana dalenga, chal bi saenga, or usme obse fasnama. Don't be trapped by the greed of having the seeds. And then the <laughs> Mahatma, he left. And Guru, he gives the mantra. Two or three days, the, the disciple chants very nicely, with great enthusiasm. Uh, the, the, the Guru said, chant ten times, the disciple chants for a hundred times. In the beginning, he wants to get everything in one day. And then Ganatarala comes. Sometimes they chant, sometimes not. And then after three or four months, uh, this Japa Mala, they, they hang up and they don't chant. And they tell to Guru, I don't have time. In this way, some chant, uh, some of the birds, they chanted the mantra, some did not. Then Sikari Ayaga, Dana Dalinga, Jal Bisaga, Lov Se Fasnamat. One day, and that one day, one hunter came, and he did exactly the same. He put some seeds there, basmati chal, very fragrant seeds of rice. He spread by the tree. Yeah, so the birds they saw, they called each other, and the Lord has been merciful and has sent this basmati rice for us. So the birds started to eat the grains of rice. The tendency of birds is to eat and keep in the throat. Sikari it was watching from far and at that time he pulled the net and the birds became trapped. There was no way to escape. Yes, then they remembered. So they remember the mantra the Guru gave, gave. And, and they cast the net 
But Gurudev said at the end, don't be caught by the greed of the seed. Now we've become trapped by this greed. Yes. Gurudev said, Gurudev said, if any difficulty, remember me. And so they began to remember Gurudev. So they chanted the mantra, Hare Krishna, Krishna, and remembered Gurudev. Hare Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. The power of mantra. And together, they started to flap their wings all together and they lifted the uh, net high above. The, the hunter had uh, just had gone just to some distance, thinking the birds will not go anywhere. And then they were seeing the birds flying in the sky with the net. And by that, uh, uh, nearby was a river. The birds, they crossed the river. The, the, the hunter could not uh, cross the river. Where they landed on the other side. Uh, the, um, the birds, they vomited the uh, grains of rice that they had kept in their throat. Uh, and at that place there were small mice and they started to be attracted to eat the rice and the net at the same time and that way the birds were freed Shri Radhe Shri Radhe this short story the meaning of which the, and the importance of which so these difficulties will come in our life. So what should we do? We should remember Gurudev's instructions and all our obstacles will be removed. Taking the mantra from Guru and chant Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna. Hare Hare. Hare Ram. Hare Ram. Ram Ram. Hare Hare. There is no need to chant any of the mantra in Kali Yuga. At the time of death, and you will attain the Lord's above. Ajamil kept his son's name Narayan. And what, what name have you given your child? Haku, Daku, Chaku, Situ, Bitu. You keep names like this? One house I went to in Mathura. <coughs> what is your child's name? I asked. D2? C2? D2? D2. <laughs> this kind of, any kind of name? Where did you get these names? I got these. I went to England. <laughs> and, uh, uh, on my boarding pass, I saw. C2. C2. C1, C2, gate number D2, C2. C2, P2. That's why I kept my children's name. There's no meaning to these names. No, you should keep your children's name, uh, Krishna name, Govinda name, and Radha Nam. Uh, very nice names. Uh, at least, uh, at least you will chant your Lord's name by calling your daughter or son. If, if you Krishna or oh Ram, Ram come, Krishna come, get up, sleep, go to school. <coughs> Ram, Ram. Oh, what you call Ram? Get up, get up. And, uh, uh, you don't even need to have mala in your hand. 
At least ten, maybe a hundred times you will be thinking of Ram. For this reason, in our culture, Vedic culture, keep a name such that you can remember Govinda. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna Prabhu in our temple. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Your chanting will be complete. If you keep Radha name. Anybody here called Radha? Radha Nam. Lalita. Very nice names. Daku, Haku, Baku, Chaku. Uh, you will not get anything from these kinds of names in the Srimad Bhagavatam. According to the pastimes of Ajamil, Shukadeva Goswami is saying in any way possible one should chant. Vaikuntanamagrahana. <coughs> Any way we should chant the Lord's name. If you have uh, back pain, uh, it's, it's not hot water. Even chanting Ram Ram. If the bad smell is coming, say Ram Ram. Hare Krishna. If you're chanting, the, if you're playing the harmonium, Hare <laughs> Krishna, you can chant in this way. In any way possible, your life will be successful. Parihasta, Sanketan, Parihasta, Soba, Halam, Eva. Agha means sinful activities will be uh, vanquished. The Bola Hari Gopala Bola Govinda Bola Hari